Hello, I'm Norma. I wanted to share with you some tips today on getting consistent weights with the Panda Warmer. So once you receive your baby, you will be drying and stabilizing your baby. And then with that wet blanket, you would either want to discard that into your linen hamper, or if you don't have the linen hamper, you'd want to make it on the center of the mattress. And then once you are ready to weigh, you wanna make sure that all of your blankets are on top of the mattress. You don't want anything over the sidewalls. You don't want anything touching the sidewalls and you don't want anything laying over the sidewalls. So there may be uh, times that a stethoscope might have dra been draped over the sidewall or maybe tubing, anything like that. You wanna make sure that the bed is completely clear. And then you also want to make sure that the bed is level. So to level your bed, you would just place your hand across the metal bar and squeeze, and then you could level the bed. This bed will actually tilt in 12 degrees either way. There is a level button on either side. So once your bed's level, then, and everything's cleared away from the side rails and the side walls, then you can go to menu, find your scale, and then go to weigh and the prompts will prompt you through weighing the baby. So it's asking me first to level the bed and I have done that previously, so the bed is level. It's asking me to wait. Now it's asking me to lift the baby. So when I lift the baby, all everything is zeroed out that's on top of the mattress. Now it's asking me to replace the baby. So once I replace the baby, it will be obtaining the weight for us. So now you can see my, my baby weighs 640 grams. My parents will wanna see a more pounds and ounces type of weight. It's also a great little time for a photo op. Now also, you can reweigh if you need to, or you could obtain your last weight from the bed. So one last tip that I have for you in obtaining consistent weights with the Panda Warmer is that when you obtain your bed, when it is shipped to your hospital, it will be set or defaulted to a 10 gram rounding for your weights. Many of you choose to decrease that 10 gram rounding to five grams. So in the future, you may want to be consistent with the 10 gram or five gram rounding so that you are getting those consistent weights. Thank you very much. I hope that these tips have been helpful. If you have additional questions, please reach out to your GE Healthcare Sales Specialist or your Clinical Education Specialist. Thank you.